What's up guys, it's Takaya and welcome to today's video. I know I'm sitting on the floor right now in front of a black leather couch, but this is just what I was feeling. I didn't feel like setting it up on a tripod because my tripod is like bootleg and if you like messing up and it's hard to set up. So I have to get a new one and I just felt like setting my camera down on my little coffee table. And I'm on the floor. But that doesn't matter, okay? So today's video, I decided that I want to show you guys all the things that I got because of YouTubers. Whether it's from a collab they did with the brand, or just a, something they created on their own, or something that they sponsored in a video, yes, because I am that person. After thinking about this video, I did not realize like how team internet I am. You know how people say like, team internet? I didn't realize how much of that I was, you know what I'm saying? Like, I really be supporting YouTubers, like y'all. They don't even know. They don't even know. <laughs> I sound like a total fangirl. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to start with Jaclyn Hill because her things were the most expensive. <laughs> like, when I come to Jaclyn Hill, I will splurge for her because I love her. The first thing, obviously, Champagne Pop. I had to get Champagne Pop. When this first came out, I was just like, oh my god. Like, hold on. I think I still have. Well, do I have a box? I don't know if I have the box, but I saved it as long as I could before I got janky and everything, but yeah, so I got this because she collabed with Becca the first time, you know, and um, this has really been through a lot, as you can see, but you know, I'm still holding on strong. She will be with me forever. Even when this is empty, I'm going to keep it. <laughs> Probably not. I don't know. I'm being dramatic. Okay, so obviously for Jaclyn Hill, I got her new champagne collection. It's upside down. I was so happy to get this. Like, this came out in a perfect time. Like, it is so beautiful. Look how big and dirty this mirror is. Like, it is huge. And it comes with a more golder highlight. This is called um, Prosecco Pop. I love love this highlight i'm sorry i keep looking at myself in the viewfinder i'm just like trying to check on my hair and stuff um i did a flexi rod set and i almost filmed it like a tutorial but i haven't done one a flexi rod set on my hair in so long so i was like ah uh. and i use new products so i was like i don't know if it's gonna turn out good so just in case it don't i'm just gonna practice this time and then if it turns out cute then i'll film it so it turned out alright, it's a little frizzy, but if you guys want to see like what I used and how I did it, then I will do that for you. And okay, now I also got her eyeshadow palette. Now I know she did discontinue it, but I am not returning it. And I am glad that I got the so-called good palette because I don't know if you guys don't know like what's going on or whatever, but she discontinued it because people got bad ones and there's a lot of videos on it. I don't want to be one of them videos that explains like that drama, but Regardless, I still love this palette and I love Jaclyn and I got a good one, so I'm keeping it. <laughs> I'm just gonna show you guys like that is a swatch. I got a good one. Let me let me just let me just show you real quick. <laughs> this is like the most unprofessional video I've done. Okay, wow. So that's a swatch. I just put took a random one in the middle. This one is cognac. Um let's grab butter it's soft it's really pigmented so you know I was like you know what I don't care if everyone's not liking theirs mine is good so <laughs> sucks to be you but I got a good one <laughs> I'm just kidding I probably did a horrible job at showing that but bottom line is I love her palette I got a good one so so yeah ew please dismiss this situation I know I got like butthole mouth right now but <laughs> and then the last thing that I got because of Jaclyn Hill well okay let me let me take this back I've gotten a lot of things because of Jaclyn Hill this isn't really a video on like the products that they recommended to me that made me buy this is more so like their what's their name is on them you know what I'm saying but I am going to mention this one thing, which obviously her name isn't on it, but she is the one who really want, made me want to get this, and it is a camera. I just got this. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's so cute. Um, I got the Sony A5100 
5100 however you want to call it and yes i seen her make a video a long time ago it was like a i don't even know when that was that was a while ago but she did like a little q a and she did it on her vlogging camera and the quality looks so good and i was just like Oh. Yeah, when she said she uses this camera for her Instagram pictures, I was like, okay, I need that. So yeah, I thought this would be great and to just do like the occasional vlog. I'm not going to be like a daily vlog or anything because like, well, I would, I would actually, but my life isn't that interesting <laughs> and I work every day of the week, so that wouldn't be fun. But anyways, for like trips that I'm taking this summer that I'm so excited about um, and just, you know, here and there vlogs I got a vlog camera so look out for some of those yeah so the next thing I'm going to talk about that I got because of a youtuber is Miami Fever by Kathleen Light she collaborated with Ofra Cosmetics and made this lipstick I actually did a tutorial featuring this lipstick and it's um, great I still wear it sometimes because you know sometimes it's kind of hard to like pair with things I broke my cap so it's like raggedy and looking ugly but it's really a good lipstick and yeah you go Kathleen because I love her and since we're on Kathleen I also got her Colourpop quad that she made it's called where the night is I really wanted to get where the light is when that first came out but my bank account said er, you can't you ain't got room to be spending money on makeup right now so I couldn't get it so I have all four of the shadows. I've actually only used these two, the Telepathy and I can't think of what this one is called. It's bothering me. Weenie. Weenie. <laughs> I've only used Telepathy and Weenie, but um, because those ones, the other colors are pretty dark and I'm like scared, a little scary cat, but I will try them one day. But as you can see, I keep them in the box. Like I treasure these like yes because I love her I love these people I'm treasuring them I'm keeping this box it's all dirty and crappy but I'm keeping it <laughs> and then along with Kathleen I got a lot of stuff from Kathleen like I support her she is like the best person ever she's so sweet and like ugh. these lippy sticks were like made to go with this quad and I got Taurus which is a matte brown color swatch it that's Taurus and I got Aquarius which is a cream finish and it's like a light pinky color it's like really pretty I didn't swatch uh, Miami Fever did I and that one on the end is Miami Fever all right the next thing I'm showing you guys that I got because of YouTube this youtuber is Missy Lynn and I got all three of these lipsticks that she made with BH Cosmetics. This is what they look like. And I'm going to swatch these two, but I don't know if I have room. Okay. I should have brought a makeup wipe over here with me, but I didn't know I was going to be doing all this. <laughs> okay, so the first one by Missy Lynn, this one is called Missy Lynn. <laughs> this one's called Missy Lynn. And it's like a again a brown I love brown lipsticks um but this one is a, also a brown it's more deeper than Taurus by Kathleen Light so this is a really deep brown color and it's so cute I might put this on instead of this this is what I'm wearing right now is Kate by Colourpop and it's just like cracking up and stuff and I'm not feeling that so I might be putting this on after this video but that's Missy Lynn, and then the next one she made is called Lamoir. Lamoir? Lamoir? I love this one too. It's like a burgundy. These are all matte too. Oh, look at that. It's so perfect. Even though it's summertime, I still, I just love dark lipsticks. I can't find my perfect nude where I haven't yet, so I just always go with dark lipsticks. And this next one that she made is called Serenity. So this one I thought would be a cute nude on me, but it's just a light pink. Like it doesn't even, it blends in with my face, you know what I mean? <laughs> so yeah, I don't really wear this one, but yeah, I got that. 
and these are really 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 inexpensive so if y'all haven't looked on BH Cosmetics for any of their products I mean they're really inexpensive um, I haven't got her palette the Missy Lynn palette but I'm thinking about going to get it I don't know why I don't have it but since that's from BH Cosmetics I might as well talk about the Kylie Barble what? Kylie Barble what? <laughs> What? I don't know. Um, I have the Carly Bible palette. I'm pretty sure you guys know who all these people I'm talking about, but I used this whole palette for my full face using only highlighters challenge. I hope you guys seen that video. If you haven't, I'll link it. But yeah, this like was a lifesaver. Like this literally you could do your full face with these highlighters. <laughs> Not really, but you know what I mean. I love like the mauve colors in this. Like this is like a perfect palette for me. The golds and like there's there's a good amount of matte and shimmer and then it comes with four different highlighters um, whenever I do someone else's makeup I always use this palette because it just has a range of colored highlighters and it's amazing you know alright the next thing I'm going to talk about is uh, dead. I love this this is from Manny MUA and Makeup Geek I also did a video on this a tutorial you if you haven't seen it I can also link that um, but this is what it looks like also a really nice size mirror nice and flimsy you could just flip it and hold it like this you know boom boom but yeah I really love this palette a lot too and I love Manny anyway like yes but yeah I'm mad I don't have any of his lipsticks that he's created but maybe one day I'll go grab those but I'm more I more so get excited about like the eyeshadows because I don't have many eyeshadows so when like people come out with palettes I'm just like all over it like I have a lot of Morphe palettes and stuff like that like I don't have single eyeshadows I just buy like palettes you know um, this next thing I got is some lashes and this is how I know like I only buy things because a youtuber made it because I've never this is by the, let me just tell you what it is this is by the brand Flutter Lashes and these are the style Slayla. <laughs> that was so ratchet. But I'm I know you guys know who Makeup by Shayla is. She is is it makeup by Shayla or makeup Shayla? Wow, I'm a fake fan. But anyways, Shayla Slayla made these lashes with flutter lashes and I this is the only pair of flutter lashes I own. You know? And yeah, I got them because she made them and they're flawless. Like I also wore these in my um my full face using highlighters challenge so if you want to see what they look like but yes I love these these are the most dramatic lashes that I have or that I've ever bought but they look really good like I had to trim them though but when you trim them like to fix your eye shape they're just like oh, amazing okay, the next thing I got is by Jeffree Star I have this liquid lipstick in the shade um, I'm nude now <laughs> I bought this and obviously this looks like a white lipstick on me but when I dab a little bit of this shade like in the center of any lipstick it just like makes it a cute little ombre and yeah that's why I'm hanging on to this I just ordered two more from him I ordered Gemini and Celebrity Skin I feel like Celebrity Skin is going to be that perfect nude that I'm looking for like to go with my face and not blend in with my face <laughs> or make me look like Dave Chappelle <laughs> but um yeah so I'm excited I'm waiting for those to come Alright, so these next products are more so like sponsors, so they don't, they're not created by a YouTuber, but like YouTube sponsored it. The next thing is this guy. <laughs> I know for a fact you guys have seen this in any of your favorite beauty um, YouTubers videos. They all use this. This is the Vanity Planet Thin Brush. So yeah, I got this spin brush and it actually is really amazing. Hey, I've seen this in multiple videos. Like they don't just use it in one video and then boom, like what happened to your spin brush? Like no, they always use it so I, I trusted it and it really is amazing. But yeah, if you're not used to a spin brush at first, to me, it was a little like scrapey and like not harshly, but it was just like something new, you know, my face wasn't used to it so it was like, ooh, 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 like when I was doing it, you know what I mean? But I got used to it and it's, really amazing I had a huge pimple right here and even going over it when I was washing my face it didn't hurt it at all because my pimples be like 
like I rarely break out but when I do break out like they're like horns like big nasty horns and so I was scared to go over it with my brush but I did it just to see and it was like so gentle it didn't even hurt but yeah so if you guys seen a youtuber use this and they had like their code and you weren't sure if you should trust it or not you can have my word for it because they did not send this to me. I got it from a YouTuber. Like, I use their code. You know what I mean? So, I think you should get it if you are considering it. It is really good. This next thing is also, like, something that's been sponsored, like, everywhere. Y'all already gonna know. <laughs> I'm just gonna say it's an app. Yes, I am talking about the game Best Fiends. Okay? I downloaded this game because I was like wow all these people literally are doing this video with this game and they're telling you to download it and stuff and I'm just like really but so out of all like laughs and giggles I was like let me download this game because like are you kidding me and I'm semi addicted but let me just show you guys I really do have it on my phone best fiends I play this game when I'm like bored at work and like there's nothing else to do I'll just play this and it actually is pretty fun the only problem I have is like with some videos I just hate how they like express the game like it's just a game like I don't see how you can get that excited over explaining it like I don't know it's not that great like it is fun you know what I mean I'm on level like I mean I'm on level 49 you can see my little face floating there or whatever but at the same time I just hate how it's like sold even though it's free download obviously but like you know what I mean like it's just a game I don't know so yeah if you're one of those people who are also annoyed by all the sponsors of this game <laughs> trust me I was too but I actually downloaded it just to be funny and it turned out to be really fun so it's a nice like time killer so whenever you're like bored it is a cool game and I really like play a level over and over and over so I beat it that's how I know I like it because otherwise I just like man forget this I ain't about to keep redoing this you know what I'm saying so it is a cool game they didn't lie about that but I just hate how it was like overly sponsored by so many people flooding I was just tired of seeing it you know I'm pretty sure everyone was but you know get them coins I feel you <laughs> comment down below if you're like me and you just love supporting like people on YouTube like it's not like I'm a crazy fangirl it's just like I know they're real people and like I am genuinely I'm, I'm always like genuinely proud when they put out things and it's just so cool and I I feel cool that I'm actually on YouTube now like I feel like we homies like we're friends we we doing the same thing even though you're like up here and I'm like down here like hey but at the same, you know what I mean it's so cool like I don't know it's pretty cool what you can do just by being on the internet like they're doing all these amazing things and it's just so cool and I'm so excited because I get to meet some of them or see some of them in person because I'm going to BeautyCon LA and I am so happy that I'm going um, I'm going with my mom I'm so happy she's going with me because at first I was gonna have to cancel my whole trip because I had no one to go with me and yeah my mom's gonna go with me and I am so happy and that's gonna be so much fun so yeah, I'm going to be vlogging that too. That's also why I got this camera. But yeah, um, so yeah, comment down below and make me feel better by telling me if you're like me or if you're not or I don't know. I hope you guys like this more chill laid back video than I'm like in front of a big old leather couch, but it was comfortable. You know, I'm just sitting here like, you know. <laughs> If you're new to my channel, before you leave, don't forget to subscribe so you can see my upcoming videos. And follow me on all my other social medias. I'll have them linked below. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Hopefully it's more, you know, appealing. <laughs> I know this isn't really that great, but whatever. Uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! But um, this palette was... Um, what was I saying? <laughs> Do my lips look too crusty to like even pay attention to what I'm saying or what? Hope not. That's how lazy I am. Like, I will sacrifice having crusty lips on camera because I don't feel like going to reapply. Whatever.